Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. You'll probably notice that today's setup is a little bit different than usual and this is because I have someone with me here today, Omar Lahida, who is our newest team member and he has recently joined the team as a dedicated financial advisor. So I want to use today's session to give you an opportunity to learn a little bit more about Omar. And we're really fortunate to have Omar. He comes with a lot of experience having previously worked at head office. So welcome, Omar, and welcome to the channel. Thank you. I'm happy to be part of the team. So I've been with Asante for the better part of a decade, and that's actually how we met. Uh, we worked on a few projects together, and uh, it made the transition just really easy, and it felt like a seamless fit. Mm -hmm. And actually, I think I came into your office the other day. I was clearing out some papers from my desk, and I had an email from, what was it, like 2017 that I had printed off, and it was a correspondence between you and I when yeah. I was getting licensed. And I didn't know at the time that, you know, this Omar was who we would ultimately be working together on the same team together. Yeah, we hadn't met face to face at that uh, point in time, but we had definitely a lot of emails back and forth. So we brought Omar on because the business was growing and we had more clients and we wanted to make sure that we could always be maintaining a certain level of service uh, and communication with our clients. So Omar having the background already, having worked at Asante, knowledge of the financial markets, and working with external partners and clients, we thought he'd be a really great fit uh, for our team here at Ferguson Financial Planning. And so over the coming months, some of our clients might be hearing from Omar in regards to things like portfolio reviews and their retirement cash flow plans. So I wanna shake things up a little bit with a quick Q&A. So we're gonna do it super fast. Um, Amber tells me I have to do it in less than one minute. So I'm going to ask you a bunch of questions and I want to hear your answers so our audience knows what you're all about. Sounds good. Omar, are you a tea or coffee guy in the morning? I feel very strongly about this. Definitely coffee. Okay. Yeah. If you could have dinner with one historical figure, who would that be? Definitely Muhammad Ali. Um, he's a great guy and he had a lot of values that I, that I respect. Good. What is your favorite book, financial or non-financial? The, the book that stuck with me the most, uh, I'm not proud to say this, is definitely Harry Potter. Uh, okay. As a kid, I read it multiple times and it definitely stuck with me over the years. That's a good one. I really yeah. want my kids to watch the movies, but you have to read the they books. said they don't want to read yeah. it and watch it yet. <laughs> if you could go on a vacation anywhere in the world right now, where would it be? I really want to go to Eastern Europe. There's a lot of culture there, a lot of history that I, uh, that I haven't seen yet. So it's the one place that I'm looking forward to. Okay, and I know this is a big one, but what motivated you to want to become a financial advisor? I grew up in Egypt and I've witnessed people who were um, at one point in their life wealthy, but because of a lack of financial planning coupled with the devaluation of the Egyptian currency, it put them in a very precarious financial situation later in life. And it was difficult to see people close to the family go through that financial hardship. And it motivated me to want to work with people uh, and make sure that doesn't happen. Oh, wow. Okay. Well, you'll definitely have the opportunity to work with a lot of people, help them with the cash flow planning to help prevent that yeah. going forward. And final question, what is one thing on your bucket list that you'd like to try and knock off? I'm scared of heights and uh, I'm the kind of person who wants to, to face their fear head on. So I, I want to I wanna go skydiving. That's the biggest thing on my bucket list. It's going to be terrifying, but it's going to be fun. Good for you. I, I don't know if I could do that, but good for you. Let me know when you've done it. Okay. Omar, very good job. Thanks for answering all the questions. If you ever need to go back and remember what those answers were, uh, this will now be permanently on the internet forever <laughs> for everyone to see. Jack, and I have a question for you. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> What's the one thing that you enjoy the most about your job? Okay, that's a good question. Uh, putting me on the spot a little bit. If I had to say the best thing I enjoy about the job it's really forming connections with people and, and learning more about individuals. And every client is so different, uh, have the same preferences, things they like, the way they like the meetings to be run, the things we talk about. So for me, it's really great when I can connect with someone, help them out with their financial situation, and then for them to come back to me later and say that they've um, maybe enjoyed working with me or that it's really made a difference in their future cash flow planning. So it's just such a rewarding experience to connect with people, to be able to help them out and for them to communicate the value of that advice you've given them. So going forward, what we can expect to see from working with Omar is that continued um, overall comprehensive wealth advice as it relates to putting together a portfolio to ensure you're invested in the right things at the right times, helping to navigate any questions that you have about the financial market, 
and also putting together those retirement cash flow plans so you can have a better understanding of what you have today, what it'll look like in the future, and how to draw down on those assets in retirement. I'm looking forward to getting to know everybody, working with them on their wealth planning, their financial needs, uh, investment planning, and navigating the financial market. Omar, I'm really excited to have you on the team and be able to continue to offer more to our clients. Um, you'll probably see Omar a little bit more on the channel. It won't just be my face anymore, but we're gonna see Omar doing a few videos of his own as well. So specifically, Omar is gonna be helping us out with some of our market commentary, so stay tuned for some of that. Hopefully you knew about that, but that's what you're filming next. <laughs> I do, and it's, uh, it's something I'm excited about. Helping people navigate financial markets is uh, something I'm very passionate about. So Omar, where can people find you online? So you can find me on LinkedIn. We'll put the, the link in the description. My full name is Omar Lihita. I'm also gonna be doing the monthly commentaries to help clients understand the financial markets and break it down for them a little bit more. Be sure to check out the link in our description for more information about Omar. If you liked today's video, be sure to subscribe and leave a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.